WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 1 p.m. Eastern Time on Friday. Three hours left to go in the trading day, and we got market near session lows. S&P's off 2.8% right now, trading 81 points in the red at 28.21. Quite a far cry from where we were early, early Thursday, 29.65. You're talking about 145 S&P points gone within the last 48 hours. NASDAQ 100 trading down 3.2%, 286 points in the red at 87.02. The Dow off 586, that's 2.4% in the red, trading 23,643. And the Russell down almost 5%, off 62 points at 12.44. Jumping over to crude, crude, up 56 cents at 19.38, quite a few days for crude. Early Tuesday at $10, we wrap up the week near about $20 if we hold where we are, and gold up about $9 at 17.03 right now. We'll check in on the VIX this afternoon as we near the end of Friday trading. The VIX spiking, almost making it to 40 right now, 38.93 as volatility comes back in this market with the indices down almost 3%. In terms of what else we have happening in the market, Elon Musk having himself quite a Friday on Twitter, if you haven't seen that. The biggest tweet of them all, this one, Tesla stock price is too high, in my opinion. Speculation over whether that was even real or hacked um, in the den earlier. Fair statement, but nonetheless, wouldn't put it past Elon being real there and putting that out. Their symbol's not Elon, what am I doing? Tesla, TSLA, check out that acceleration, folks. Now, we're looking at a 15-minute chart. They're their earnings on Wednesday night, yes. There's Thursday's Friday trading trading action actually finishing the red after being at 686. And how about that? $200 it gave back in the tweet at 10 past 11 this morning. So there's your acceleration from about 760 bucks to $680 on that tweet. Now sitting at $720. Volatility in Tesla down about 8% today at 719. Talk about being down today. How about Amazon? Down a similar almost 8%. Amazon saying that they will probably make about no profit in the coming quarter because of COVID-19 related expenses and their earnings down $192. And Apple down 1.1% after accelerating out of the gate to positive territory as the market has slid a bit. Apple off $3 at $290. Stay tuned, folks. Steve Rhodes live at 1 o'clock. Dave White live at 2 o'clock. Tom O'Brien live at 3 o'clock. Have a great Friday.